Hey guys, so I'm going to show you how to use the smart scroll on the uh, Galaxy S4. First of all, there's two ways you can do it. And what you do is um, you want to go into your settings and go into your settings, click on my device, and you want to go down to uh, where it says smart screen. And you have smart scroll here. What you want to do is you want to enable it. Now, by default, it's going to be. Um, sync to tilting device so you can either tilt the device or you can do a head head tilt basically move your head up and down so i'm going to leave it on the default i'm going to go to uh tilting device now take note guys a lot of people are saying it's not working for them uh it's probably because you're using like google chrome this 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 um smart scroll only works with um stock apps so the internet you have to use internet explorer if you have google chrome or using opera uh, it's not going to work. So anything third party is not going to work. It has to come stock with it. Uh, even the Gmail, if you download your Gmail account, your Gmail app from uh, Google Play Store, it's not going to work. You have to use the one that came with the phone. So anyway, so remember, you have to use Internet Explorer. So let me click on Internet Explorer here. And here's an article here. Now let me show you how the, uh, the tilt works, okay? I hope you can see this. Uh, okay, so anyways... Basically, it locks into your eyes, and then you can kind of like, I can scroll down. Yeah, okay, great, okay. And you want to scroll back up, you go down, or you face it up like this. Now, the thing is, like, once I move my my face out of this direction for a while, it's, it, it didn't register with my eyes. So we just give it a while. Okay, there we go. See, now it doesn't work. What you have to do is let me go back in here. I'll put it on my. There we go. When I see that green icon, now I can uh, tilt it up. Stop it. Read it. Go down. Go back up. Read it. Anyways, it has to sink in with your eyes. So let's do the other option. Let's go to. Um, let's do the head tilt. So let's go back into the settings. And this is cool too. If, if you want to leave it on default, um, you know, it's on the tilt right now. What you can do is just s slide it down and click on um, Smart Scroll here. Or what you can simply do is you can just use two fingers and swipe down. And you can do it this way as well. Anyways, let's go back into the Smart Scroll and let's let's sync the, uh, the head tilt. So let me just go back into Settings, My Device, go to Smart Screen. And then we'll click on Smart Scroll again. And then let's do the head tilt. Okay, so from here what I'll do is I'll go back into Internet Explorer because again, Google Chrome's not going to work. Okay, so basically, now, I don't know if you guys can see this or not, but there's like a blue eye, a blue eyeball, a blue eye, a blue icon. It's the icon with the eye, it's blue. And once your eyes get synced, uh, then you know it's like working. And then it's like... See, I'm, I'm reading it down. Okay, I'm reading it. Let me go down. Hey, wait, I missed something. Let me move back up. Move back up. Move back down. Now, the thing is, like, once I do this, I mean, it won't do anything. See? What I have to do is I have to sync my eyes again. See the blue? And then it turns green. Wait, it's on blue right now. There's the green. Now I can go back. So, it takes a little while to get used to, guys. But, um, I mean, once you have it, it's pretty cool. But, um, yeah, like I said, so the main thing is make sure you use a stock app. Can't use Google Chrome, guys, sorry. So if you have any questions or anything regarding uh, Smart School, uh, just comment below. Thanks, guys.